Hello, Rathians and Rabble Rousers. My name is Tibius Guy, and welcome back to Monster Hunter World. We are still on the grind, and we're going to be staying on the grind because the grind never stops, and that's when you put in like a few emoji the, with like the snorting emoji and the, the sweat emoji, I guess, and the praying emoji. I think that's what you do, and that's that's how you show that you're on on the grind. You do you do you're doing the work. You you're getting the bread. Uh, <laughs> as the young as the young uns say these days. I, however, have a bunch of Rathians that I need to kill because I want to upgrade my poison sword. And after I've killed those Rathians and upgraded my poison sword, then I want to kill some Puke Puke so I can get some poison attack bonus boost buff from its belt. And then I might want to kill some more Rathians so I can get their armor, because uh, fire resistance, or maybe I want to get the Anginath, like I'd kind of settle on that, I don't know. Anyway, before I do any of that, I have to remember to do something, I have to remember to thank the people in the comments. Because you guys are genuinely extremely helpful, actually. Um, the trouble with, with, with the, the, the way that I'm doing these videos is that I will ask a question like, Hey, what the hell is Monster Broth? What's that for? And then, uh, you know, it's it's uh, I'm gonna make the video, and then I'm gonna upload the video to the channel, and then I'm gonna keep making videos. And so, you guys will see the video and answer my question, and I'm already gonna be like two videos further into the series before I get to read the ends. Like I'm recording this video on Tuesday morning, pretty much. It's gonna be going up. Is it Tuesday today? I can't actually remember if it's Tuesday. Okay, it is Tuesday, thank, thank God. I'm recording this on a Tuesday morning, and it's gonna be going up on a Wednesday evening, and then I'm, and after I'm done recording this video, I'm gonna record one, maybe two more videos that are then gonna be going up on Thursday. <laughs> um, and so, so anytime I ask a question here, I'm gonna be like two or three videos ahead that I've, where I've played through stuff after having asked the questions, still making, like, still not knowing the answer because I don't want to look it up on Google. And it's a bit silly, because I could just look it up on Google, though, like, and then not make the same mistake for two extra videos while I wait to see what my comments say about, you know, a video that's, like, two and a half hours back in my playtime, but... I mean, this is silly, but I... I I like getting the answers from you guys. Uh, it's I've, I've talked about this on my vlog channel, I think, a little bit. Um, but I like having that connection. Like, I like having that... Uh, that, that, that little bit of conversation, that little, that little bit of interaction uh, with you guys. I like that. And... I... I <laughs> I kind of don't want to give it up just to make it easier for myself by, you know, actually, let's Honda Puke Puke right away since it's here. Uh, just just to make it easier for myself. Because, you know, I, I don't get to have a lot of direct interaction with my audience these days. Because, like, even, even a relatively small channel like my main one with 50,000 subscribers, like, that's still... That's still more people and more comments a lot of the time than it's easy to comfortably handle, so I found this little this little bit of connection with you guys where I can sort of directly talk to you and interact with you, and then now I don't want to give it up. <laughs> so, so I'm gonna keep asking a question about a dumb mistake I'm making, and then keep making the mistake for two or three videos because I haven't seen the answer yet. And that's just how this series is gonna have to be, because I, I'm ridiculous and silly and deeply irrational. <laughs> And I'm okay with it. All right, Puke Puke, where are you? Right below me? I'm vaguely tempted to set up a trap ahead of time, but nah. It's a Puke Puke. I think I can handle it. Do -do 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 -do. And rocks fall, everybody dies! Oh. <laughs> I set it up so nicely and then it didn't work. Okay. 
Oh well. Uh, that was silly. I gotta say, the fadeaway slash builds a lot of meter. What's he doing? Oh, right, he eats rocks. That's what he does. Damn it. I thought I had the fadeaway slash going. But I guess I didn't. Got the damage boost. Nice. Okay, this should be relatively simple. Like, I've come close to death with a Puke Puke before, because I'm occasionally very bad at this game, but I think I'll be able to handle this one, all things considered. Just want to cut off his tail, though. Come down here. Come down here. Come down here! Thank you. Damn it. I was hoping to get a ride, but oh well. There we go. That's the tail. I think. Was it the tail? Nope. It was something else. Okay. I want the tail, though. Give me the tail! Well, okay, he did... He, he, I, I asked for that, quite literally. There we go. It did knock him out of my range, though, so that sucks, but oh well. I think I've got it this time. Yes, nice. Why do I have that song in my head? Why, 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 why did that song get in my brain? It's not even November. And I realize people who aren't at least Scandinavian probably won't have any idea what I'm talking about there, but... He's eating rocks again. Oh, well. I'll use that as an opportunity to harvest his tail. And maybe sharpen? I think I can make it. Yeah. <laughs> Dumbass. You had the perfect opportunity to distract me, and you failed! But that always works on me. I keep... I can't read the animation wind-up for his charge. And I think a big part of the reason is that I keep insisting on trying to, like, finish the full, uh... spirit combo. when there is, in fact, a reasonable argument that I shouldn't try to do that. Ah, I've also been informed something that I didn't know. Uh, the reason why my foresight slashes sometimes fail is that they're not a dodge, they're a parry. You have, you have to, you have to use, you have to get hit by something in order for it to work, as it turns out. Which makes me feel a lot better about trying to use it, actually, because that means I can take the hit. Like, I can deliberately get hit by something into... Okay, did not expect that. Uh, I can deliberately let myself get hit by something while using the Foresight Slash, and then it will work. Because what I was doing before is I was trying constantly to, like, use the Foresight Slash to dodge rather than use it to parry, which... Um, Like, which obviously doesn't work.
But really, like, the... I, I feel like the secret to getting the Foresight Slash to work is just to use it all the freaking time. And then eventually, just by the law of large numbers, you're gonna be right. <laughs> like, you're gonna... you're gonna hit. Got the damage boost back, that's nice. No? Okay. Yeah, like that. That works. And a boom! Well, not as much damage as I would have liked. Let's go pick up the things he's dropping, because they're useful. Like, they don't do a ton of damage, but it's free damage from range. And I'm happy to take that. Yeah! Nice! Oh, it feels so good! And as you can see, I'm in an online session again. Not because it does anything especially, I, I, I've yet to- Oh, come on! Really? That doesn't hit? I mean, the hitbox on that stab is usually so generous. Damn. Bad timing. He's gonna go eat rocks again. Okay, fine. I'll just sharpen. You are only giving me time to grow stronger. Your pathetic attempts to strengthen yourself have in fact strengthened me. Ah, oh, well, that works. <laughs> ba 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 Neat. There's really nothing else to do. Well, we might as well. I mean, we're here. And it's fun. <laughs> and it's an opportunity to see just how far it reaches. Okay, so it only it reaches all the way out to here, really. So in terms of trapping a monster so that it'll get hit, I actually have a lot of leeway. Unlike with the falling rocks, where clearly I need to be a lot more careful in how I place my traps. Or else just use the uh, pitfall trap, because that kind of that kind of sucks the monster in rather than just stunning them where they stand. All right. Hey, a bird viver and gem. Is that a trade-in thing? Or can I use it to craft stuff with, I wonder? It's certainly valuable, but I'm not selling it. Not right now, anyway. If it's a trade-in item, I can always sell it later. Someone actually made a decent point in the comments that I've been assuming that it's the B-52 that's the monster I've been, whose tracks I've been picking up, but the monster whose track I've been, tracks I've been picking up is a Rathian, and the B-52 isn't, like, a, or a Rath, a, a Rath, Rathian, Rathalos, one of those family of creatures, but the, the B-52 isn't necessarily one of those... And so I can't help but wonder. And so the point they were making is you should try and go to on the quest and see if you can't beat it. Like, see if you can't. 
rather than assume that you're going to be unable to beat it because you think you know what it is. And I'm tempted to do that just because maybe it would get the goddamn handler to shut up about going on the damn quest. <laughs> Trying to remember to eat. Oh, also, uh, I need to grab my oven roast things. There we go. And so I'm, I'm tempted to just do that once. Since it's a Rathian, though, I feel comfortable in assuming it'll have fire as part of its attacks. So... Let's just have a little... The Rathian male has some fire assists. Not as much as the Sora hide. It also has a recovery up, though. Hmm. Still, I'll take the higher fire resistance. And the Rathian van braces, since, you know, why not? Not that I have thunder attack, but, you know. I'll take the Sora Spine. And I've got the Anjanath Helm. And I'll take the Alloy Greaves because I want speed sharpening. So, we're going to take a shot at it. Oh, wait, not Expedition. Um, we're going to take a shot at the quest, and we'll see what happens. And then when I die ignominiously and fail... We'll go back to the grind, which is where we belong. <laughs> I could also just open the quest up, and maybe some of the other hunters on this particular instance want to join me, but... Somehow, I doubt it. Plus, I don't want to monster hunt with Rando. Why are you here again? Handler, we know what happens when you come out on quests. We know what happens. Capcom writes an excuse for you to get into trouble so I can save you and look cool. Oh, wow, I'm psychic. Wow. <gasps> My kitty cat! My kitty cat fell down because of you! What the? A pink Rathian? Okay, my kitty cat is okay. Everything's fine. My kitty cat is okay. Whoa. Okay, just how sharp do my weapons need to be to get through that? If you ride a monster here, we will try to capture it. Is that what you're saying? Well, all right. Well, I was right. It has fire. So let's see if I can... Oh, oh, she's quick. They are quick. I don't know if they're female. Damn it. What the hell? They poison too. Of course they do. They have poison in their tails, so that leads me to suspect... Female Rathian. I need to remember that I can still run while drinking a potion. Okay. Yes, hello. Where are my rations? Oh, doesn't matter. Ligiana's here. That's wonderful. Oh. 
Thank you for the help. We have a Ligiana to deal with also. Okay. Well, this went from shit to shittier. At least the Ligiana's helping. Sort of. In like a vaguely hostile kind of way. This sucks! This sucks so bad! Help! Oh, she went to sleep for some reason. Okay. Presumably the Ligiana will wake her up, but in case she doesn't... Oh, come on, the boomerang. Why did it go that direction? I'm gonna get my ass kicked by the Ligiana, aren't I? Could I get you to blow the barrel up for me, maybe? No? No chance? Okay. Well, okay, that works. That, I'll take it. Also, bye! Okay, the Ligiana is chasing me. The Rathian isn't? Oh, no, no, that's chasing me too. Hi! I am very tired. And I'm in trouble! Oh! Okay, got away from the from the Ligiana. Got away from one of them. All right. Good, great. That's lovely, fantastic, wonderful. I I I adore every second of this. And I my sword can't hurt it. This is great. Okay, flash pods. Yeah. Well, okay, I guess I managed to break some of its armor. God, I hope it's its armor. Motherfucker! Okay, got the damage boost. That's something. Uh, thank God I have speed sharpening. I guess the Tsitsi Yaku is in this now, too. Not that I mind, especially. It uh, gives me a moment to... consider my life choices up until this point. And I certainly don't mind... The okay, so this thing is armored, and I have to crack the armor off of it. I can see the rocks on its back, or the spines or scales or whatever the hell those are. This is why people told me to bring dung pods into more fights. Because, <laughs> yeah, no, I, you're right. You are absolutely right. Definitely bring dung pods. Okay, she's raging. Motherfucker! My weapon has blue sharpness, and I still can't reliably chunk through that thing. But yeah, this very much confirms my suspicion that, like, the one of the differences between the monsters is not necessarily moveset. Like, this thing moves like a Rathian. Entirely. But it also just moves much more frequently and much more aggressively, and I would argue faster... Oh, fucking hell, that was close. Son of a bitch. You're doing so good, little kitty cat. I'm I'm so pleased with you.
Oh, good. The Sitsuyaku is back. Okay, I did some damage to it at least. Oh, no, wait. The Sitsuyaku is below us. What the heck are those? Why are they here? Those are just wing drakes, right? Hi. I, I guess you're just around. Okay. All right. All right. She's going somewhere. <sighs> okay. Okay. I'm slowly, I'm slowly getting a handle on this, I think. I think. Oh, I would love for you to land down here. You know why? Because of that! Because the ground is swampy! I should have sharpened my weapon while I had the chance. Dodge, 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 dodge! <laughs> oh, dodge! More dodging! J dodge forever! Dodge forever! Forever dodge. And hope that... So I don't know what mechanism causes the beasties to get trapped in these water things. Oh, Christ, that was close. Okay, so there's clearly armor somewhere there. Or else I just need... I just can't have green sharpness weapons. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Okay. That might be it. That might be it. Nope. Still alive. Also still poisoned. Okay, not poisoned anymore. For now. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, I forgot. I wish I could drink my demon drug, but I just don't think there's time. I should have done that while I had the chance, really. But I was interested in trying to chase her down. Which is working out so well. Okay, giving it a shot. Okay, well, I have a damage boost now for all the good that'll do me. Why didn't I take more defense? Well, I couldn't, because I wanted the, f the health boost. Which is kind of like defense. Really. Oh, please let me cut your tail off. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, I'd like to fight somewhere where there's more room! Okay, she's tired, thank God. Please hit. Yes! Damage boost! <laughs> Is she flying away? No? No? Okay, she's not flying away. I need an arena. Preferably one that doesn't come with Ligianas. I guess this is the best I'm gonna get down here. Yeah, the legs are definitely armored. A lo oh, god damn it! I was so close to finishing the combo. For all the good that'll do. Please fly away. Oh, thank god. Okay. I guess we have to hunt her, huh? I guess we have to do that? Alright. Sure, why not? So I'm about as scared of her as I am of, like... Ow! Any other Rathian, plus a bit more. Because she can do that to me. Damn it. Damn 
Turns out fire resistance isn't really what I needed. I needed more poison resistance, preferably perfect poison resistance. Oh no! Oh, oh god. Oh lord. It really feels like the best strategy is just to hit her two times and then dodge the hell out of the way of whatever she's gonna do to punish you. I'm out of flash pots. And apparently her tail is armored. Let me cut your tail. Let me do it, please! Oh, oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> the Sitsuyaku came to help, kind of. Where the hell is it? Oh, it's running away, wisely. <laughs> okay. So it's doable to like, more or less permanently dodge her and then just run away. It's just gonna be a really long fight, basically. So, but it's, 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 it's more or less kind of relatively speaking doable. Unless, of course, she does that. I don't recognize... Well, I do recognize that move. I recognize the animation. Putting the Vitality Mantle on would probably not be the worst idea. See? Oh, oh fucking hell. God, let me cut your tail, you... Ow, bastard. Okay, you still get stunned with the Vitality Mantle. Great. Good to know. And you probably still get poisoned also, so I'm not gonna test that out. Hey, there's a Sleep Toad over here, did you know? Woo! Well, not enough to put her to sleep, I see. Or else she has to be there when the thing actually activates. Okay. I can survive that. And she's buggering off again. Right. It's gonna have to be like this. It's gonna have to be a bunch of... Half fights like this. Where I just chip away damage at her. And hope that she doesn't have a mechanic where she regenerates at all. Because that would suck. Oh my god, did she go back to where the... Legiana is? Oh, no, but not that far away. Is she back in her lair? Is she asleep? I sure wouldn't mind that. Oh no, that does not sound asleep at all. Definitely not asleep. Uh, I hate it when they do that. Um... Yeah, I hate it when they do that! There's just not enough space here. This is gonna go badly. No, it worked! It worked! Holy shit, I can't believe that worked. But this, this, this combat area just doesn't work. It's bad. We can't do that. There's probably a way to manipulate it into being advantageous, but... I don't know what that is, so we're not doing that. Why is your tail armored? That seems unfair.
Come here. Come on. You dragon jackass. That's better. Uh-oh. No! Ah, okay, didn't get poisoned. Thank God. But I saw that move coming. Okay. Yeah, uh, we're just gonna have to do it like this. Because that baby has a bunch of health. Good lord. Ow. Okay, that felt a little unfair, but it probably wasn't. Okay. Hmm. There's a little path here. Ooh, mining outcrop. I'll take it. I wonder where this leads. These are some very pretty caves. Can't believe I haven't found them before. Sorry, lady, you're gonna have to wait a sec. I need to explore this. Now, there's clearly a path behind the waterfall. Do I have to break my way into it? Hmm. How do I get back there? Oh well, as uh, questions for another time. Right now there's a bastard dragon that needs a sword in the face. several swords in the face, repeatedly, for long periods of time. Okay, where's she going? Up here. I don't have a camp up here, do I? I do not. Now she's closing in on the Ligiana. I'm gonna go get my flash pods back, because goddamn, I'm gonna need them. Might also be worth grabbing some uh, dung pods, <laughs> just in case the Ligiana... Shows up. Dung pots, where are you? Okay, we're not dead yet. We remain conspicuously alive. In spite of everything. Yeah, she's back in the Ligiana's arena. Hi. What the hell? Did one of those little assholes... Did one of those little assholes... Did one of them... Oh good, the Ligiana's here. I am just going to uh, not be here for a sec. Hi, just ignore me. I'm not here. You two fight it out. You seem to have a conversation, a, a bit of an argument going on, and I'm perfectly happy to let you continue that. And just pretend like I'm not here! God damn it! Bye! Okay. Perfectly happy to let those two hash it out. They're both coming for me now, aren't they? Yup! 
<laughs> why can't you just fight each other? Why do you have to, like, why do you always suddenly remember, wait, where the fuck is that guy? Go get him! Why is that always the thing? Can't you two just kill each other for me? Is it so wrong that I attempt to exploit your mutual animosity for my own benefit? I'm just trying to do what humans always do. I think the spore puff does blind enemies. But I have no idea how long it lasts or how effective it... Did her fireball just fail? And I can't cut the fucking tail because it's armored! That can't be right. Ah, it looks like she's lost the ability to do fire. Oh, hello, Sitsuyaku. Are you here to be an asshole again? Because if so, I would recommend being an asshole to the big girl. Not to me. I'm small. I don't matter. You don't want to be an asshole to me. You want to be... Oh, no, no. She can fire. She can fire again. It's working perfectly. But yeah, like I said, we're taking this as slow as we possibly can. Ah, ah, ah. No, 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 no. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh, thank God she was blinded. Okay, got a little bit of a damage boost. Not gonna get the full one, though. Slinger bombs. I'll take them. It's free damage. And I'll take my stones back, please. Okay, I can damage the tail. I just can't damage the root of the tail. Ow! Okay, those were just stones. I didn't need them. <gasps> oh my god! Oh my god! Now. Probably quite a bit of that damage was done for me by the Ligiana. <laughs> If I'm honest. But I will take it. I will take it. Holy shit. Good lord, this video is already 43 minutes long? How? Am I gonna have to go past the Ligiana? Oh no, she's she's gone to another area. Thank god. I am gonna have to go past those little bastards, though. You little sons of bitches. Well, if she's sleeping... Then surely... I can't, I, I can't set traps here. Oh, I can. I can. I just have to be a little... Alright. There. That should do it, right? That should hit her. It doesn't. Okay. Just in case. Just in case I can't get her to get trapped. Okay. Uh, trank bombs. Trank bombs! Oh my god. <sighs> oh. Jesus Christ. 
Jesus Christ, but I did it! <laughs> I, I, I managed it barely. With absolutely no grace whatsoever, I did it. Ah! Holy shitballs! Really wish I had taken poison resistance with me. Advanced armor sphere, nice. Oh, good lord. Earn the right to take on level seven assignments. I don't think I will. I think I'll, I think I'll, I'll stick with, uh, maybe later. Maybe once I have a slightly better weapon that can actually cut things. I'm genuinely kind of distressed by how much I was not able to cut her. Never thought we'd find her in the Coral Highlands. It takes a small combination of miracles for a subspecies to emerge. At least that's what the scholars said. All the same, she's in remarkable condition. Yeah, because I captured her. Although she does not seem to be breathing in this cutscene. She must have grown somewhere rich in nutrients. I might know where that is. Admiral! <laughs> At last he returns. I've been enjoying watching your exploits. Are those guys twins? <laughs> well done. Would it have killed you to help instead of just watching? Maybe I should turn the voice volume up a little bit. Shiny. Interesting. Where'd you get him? You know where you drove off, Big Ugly? Well, there's a spot further in there. <laughs> and it's just loaded with these things. They're incredible. It's like there's this energy pulsing inside them. It wasn't just me then. <laughs> I'll wager they tie into this whole thing we've been studying somehow. Well, I intend to find out how. Raise your hand or paw if you're with me. Any of these jaggy brains up for a challenge? <laughs> these two. <laughs> Do they have the same voice actor? What? <laughs> okay, you two. See you on site. I'll be at the tunnel. Don't you keep me waiting. I hate waiting. I like waiting. Waiting means there's less of a chance of dying in the meantime. I'm definitely gonna keep him waiting. Alright, partner. Time for an expedition into the Everstreet. The Admiral said don't be late. The Admiral is gonna have to wait until I have a better weapon. Maybe also some better armor. And more items. And also that I'm better at the game. <laughs> Oh, good lord, okay. Wait, can I complete any deliveries? Don't think I can. No, there's the ice proof mantle and there's the ancient sea bream. And they are the ones I've got. Everyone has quests for me now. New products in stock. What do you have that might be useful to me? Cool drink. Well, that feels like it might be useful or important for something somewhere down the line. Oh, we have some trap tools in the box as well. Oh, right, 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 right. I remember. I remember these two. People advised me to buy these and just keep them in my inventory because they provide passive power bonuses. And that sounds like an incredibly good idea, actually. <laughs> I'll just see. Uh, from item box. Sell trade in items. I have none. Okay. Okay, so if I want to 
Yeah, so there's definitely most money to be made in selling... ...crafting materials, I see. As one might expect. But I also need them! I need all of them, even the low... ...low, low, low level ones, because... ...especially if I want to try a new weapon or something... ...I'm gonna need... ...the low level, uh... I'm gonna need the low-level items in order to craft those, so... Uh, well, actually, maybe it's worth selling some of these. Nope, they're not worth anything. Okay. No point selling them, then. Do you have a quest for me, or can you just meld new stuff? Okay, you can meld new decorations. Isn't that nice? Oh, actually, am I... Oh, I might want some of those. The trouble is, I have to meld other jewels in order to get it, and it's not like I've got a million of them lying around, you know? All right. Oh, that's right. I think I see a way to make the harvest box bigger. Is it by make having a bigger box and then putting it where the smaller box used to be? Because I think we could do that in an afternoon. No, okay, I guess you need materials. Fine. I'll go deliver that, because... Sure, bigger harvest box, fine. I, I don't mind having that. Even if it'll cost me a good chunk of my research points at this point. I am running out of them! So how do you farm research points? Just doing hunts, I guess? Any more quests around the place? No? Good. I think... Did the Tail Raider Safari come back? I... Feel like I saw it pop up. But I wasn't paying attention properly, so... Oh, yeah! Joskes Adventurers! Okay, so there's low and high rank versions of that as well. Let's see. Actually, could you help me out with some Anjanath pieces? I would greatly appreciate that. <laughs> I'm starting to get tempted to download DLC for this game. Because like, at this point, I feel like I've gotten... I've gotten my $60 worth, as it were. And I would feel okay with paying a bit more for more stuff for this game. Because clearly I'm going to be playing it for a good long while. Like, this wasn't a one-and-done kind of thing. This wasn't something that just fizzled out like so many other fucking AAA games are. This has some staying power. So does the pink Rathian... Oh, it has its own armor. And it's pink! Oh, that's adorable! Oh, poison duration up. Interesting. So, increase evade distance. Alright, what's the... And it has poison attack. Reduce recharge time for specialized tools. That would be mantles and stuff like that. Yeah. Windproof handicraft. Extends the weapon's sharpness gauge. Right, I remember that. Oh, that's not terrible. Not that I'm going to be able to build that for a while, because goddamn that Pangrathian, though. No, I don't want to forge an iron katana. I want to see if the pink Rathian has revealed... Like, if encountering that Pink Rathian has given me a clue about... Yeah, I need Pink Rathian scales for whatever comes next after the Verde Blade. And I would imagine also for some of these, maybe? Or is that a blue Rathian?
Oh, wait, I can actually carve the... I can actually make this. So I could either get the Dragon Bone Stabber, which has Elder Seal, which is going to be good for Elder Dragons, but which not really isn't useful for anything else. Or I could get the Magda Facultas. Oh, I can use my mouse here. Well, that makes things easier. But still no clue on how to get the next level of the Black Steel. Or any of its derivatives. Okay. Alrighty then. Right, I wanted to hunt a low-level Toby Kadachi so that I could upgrade the electric weapon a couple of times. Because that's the only way to get into an ice weapon, first of all. And it's also the only weapon to get some in the way I can get some electricity going. And I would rather like to have some electricity going. I want to have electricity going, and I want to have... Like, I want to have some elemental weapons of various kinds. So that I can use them when I run into something that's weak to something. Just to make the hunts a little easier. I, I was told in the comments, by the way, that for elemental weapons... They have, like, a, like when you hit something with an elemental weapon and it has... Attack rating... Blah, blah. Of elemental. Then... That's applied to each hit as a, like a flat, like it's it's not influenced by the attack rating of the rest of your weapon. It's just, it's, it's influenced only by its own attack rating. And so from that perspective, the best way to optimize that damage would be to get a, like some, some rapid hit weapons, which the, the longsword does do some rapid hits, but apparently that kind of stuff is more efficient with stuff like the dual blades. Apparently, like, in, in so far as I could understand, like, you get more efficiency out of it. Which, again, doesn't matter so much to me because I'm pretty invested in these goddamn long swords, and I'm not about to, uh, start thinking too much outside the box at this point. Ooh, but, uh, oh, I could be, I could be convinced to do this, though. Can I upgrade my attack charm, too? Yes. And I'll equip it. No, I won't. I'll, I'll equip the defense charm, because <laughs> let's be honest, I need it. I need defense. I need to not get punched in the face and die all the time. Okay, well, this seems like a decent place to cut this video. That was the pink Rathian. Uh, pink Rath, pink Rathian. It was the pink one. It is that bastard. Not the B-52. Interesting. I guess that'll come up as a monster in a later quest, maybe? So I don't have to I don't have to be able to beat it yet. Thank God. Still, I want to at least get my goddamn poison weapon, which means I have to hunt a few Pookie Puke so I can get the belt that gives me poison attack, and some Rathians so I can get the sword that gives me like poison damage at all. So, thank you all very much for tuning in to this episode of Monster Hunter World. We are still on the grind, although the roadblock that I was preparing for has been unexpectedly taken care of because I somehow managed to desperately flail my way through that. If you'd like to join me on stream for Monster Hunter as usual, then there's instructions on that down in the description, and that happens at 8pm Central European Standard Time on twitch.tv slash tbskyne. That's part one of the plugging. Part two is that I've also got a merchandise store and a Patreon and tip jars and all kinds of stuff that you can also find links to in the description, unless I've done something wrong. And yeah, like, comment, and subscribe, and do the YouTube things, because that's how YouTube channels stay alive. Thank you very much for watching. Can't believe I beat that thing. <laughs>